What's going on guys, it's JC Flames here and today I'm going to show you how to create an artist profile on SoundCloud. Uh. Me, me, also known as JC, spent my whole life in hell, also known as AC, riding around up in the hoopty, the struggle, no AC, used to have a Monte Carlo with stains and leather seats, I got plans to make it outside, uh. to all my teachers with the outcome, uh. the ones that said I never mount tonight, ain't no one for selling dust but I'm about one, like, I'ma make it out, I promise. This. I'ma be something regardless uh, I'm sick of always being modest On my goals, I swear to you I will accomplish I'ma be somebody I'ma be somebody Alright guys, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go to SoundCloud.com which I am already here and you're going to want to create an account. Now for um, the sake of this video, I'm going to go ahead and create a different account because I have my main one but I'm, I'm just showing you guys how to do it. So um, contrary to what you guys think, um, and contrary to those videos that I created um, about uh, Spotify and, and iTunes, uh, which is Apple Music now, and also with uh, Tidal and other ones like that, you have to usually claim your artist profile, right, to upload songs from there. Uh, well, SoundCloud, the good thing about that is it's just like Audius, where when you create your account, it automatically claims your profile for you. So creating your account is your artist profile. So we're going to want to go ahead and do that. I'm going to go ahead and use my other email. And go ahead and click continue. And then I'm going to go ahead and think of a password. We are good. Go ahead and confirm this. Traffic lights. And it should populate right now. So you tell them your age, which I'm going to go ahead and okay, just kind of doing this to keep going. Okay, so tell us a bit about yourself. Now, um, usually what I like to do is, okay, so you want to display your name, right? And with this one, I'm always going to do JC Flames music which is fine so this is your display name this is what people are going to see right when they go to your profile so i'm going to go ahead and get started and at the top right here so it's okay so it's going to ask you what kind of music you want i, I totally forgot about this so your favorite genres i usually do uh, hip-hop um, i'll do rock r and b let's even do some feel good and why not put some pop and lo-fi up in it Go ahead and continue. So it's uh, gonna ask you to pick a playlist, which I, I don't usually care. Now, um, guys, keep this in mind with SoundCloud, it's just like Audius where you can listen to other artists and a lot of independent artists as well. And you don't get necessarily copyright claimed when you put a lot of your own music on here, even if it's remixes, covers, all that stuff. You don't necessarily get um, copyrighted on here or any kind of flags or anything like that like you would on YouTube or even other platforms that you might want to be careful for. So SoundCloud I believe is just like Audius where you don't um, get copyright uh, striked for it. Um, so it's going to ask you to pick a playlist but I I'm not going to do that right now. So um, it's for some reason taking me to this which I don't know why but I'm gonna go ahead and reload it but anyways for that thing that pops up you guys want to just disregard it so the next thing you're gonna to want to do is go ahead and click on your profile which this is mine and I'm gonna go ahead and upload an image header footer actually before you do that my apologies is you're going to want to oh my, I guess it does let you do that which is fine but let's go ahead and take care of that later Okay, so before you do that, you're going to want to okay upload your, your profile picture, which is going to be right here, and then your banner. The f one of the first things you're going to want to do is, of course, upload a song, right? So they do have a Pro Unlimited, but you have to pay monthly for that. Uh, I forgot what the price is. I think it shows you right here on the Pro Plans. You go ahead and click it right here. It's, oh, it's $12 a month. Um, usually I do the basic and I would recommend the basic you guys unless you start getting a lot of plays and then SoundCloud will start to pay you for it just kind of like Spotify or iTunes or those uh, type of streaming platforms but 
I would go ahead and start with the free first until you start getting enough plays and reshares on your music to where you can start making some kind of small income. And then you can go ahead and do the twelve dollars a month. You know, whatever you find is worth it. But I would recommend just starting with the free. So this is already the free version, mind you. And um, what you're going to want to do is I usually uncheck this to make a uh, playlist when multiple files are selected. But usually what I do is um, go ahead and get started. And actually, this is just talking about how to repost your music, all that stuff. So usually just go down here and you can choose your song right here. Um, to upload right um, so you're gonna wanna go ahead and go back oh that's the reason why I have to verify my email address so um, I want to go ahead and do that go ahead and uh, click on a separate email go ahead and log into that so I can verify it it kind of won't let me do anything until I do so um, usually I'm just being signed in on here, which is fine. I've got my password here, guys. Kind of just bear with me. I'm going to want to switch this account. It always logs me into this account for some reason instead of no other account, so go ahead and do this one yep verify it's me correct this just bear with you guys so once I click on here it's gonna ask you so this is the first thing that I got and I'm gonna go ahead and confirm my email and sometimes creating your own profile and stuff like that you guys are gonna need to do that so if you notice that it wouldn't let me do anything or let me upload a song yet until I verified my email which is fine so you guys are gonna make sure you want to do that then you can upload your first track so one of the first tracks I do want to upload is one of my latest tracks called flawed but trying so I'm gonna go ahead and go into production go into my mastered songs FYI you guys are gonna want to keep folders for your songs try to keep it as organized as possible so your desktop doesn't look crazy and um, believe me when I say I've already done that and um, I've had those days where my desktop is just crazy so one of the things it's gonna ask you is to upload your image which we're gonna do that here and that is to this one right here that is flawed but trying cool and go ahead and rename it because that was a different title for the genre this is you can kind of you can kind of like uh, choose from a lot of genres right here mine's hip-hop of course so some of the additional tags you guys are going to want to use this kind of just like you would use hashtags when you're posting on social media so I can do hip-hop and then I'm gonna do tab rap tab um, R&B which is fine tab uh, just kind of the some of the main ones now, mind you, one of the things I do like to do, you guys, is I like to say um, to listen to more of my music, my music, click on my profile. And one of the things I do right here is download full song at, and this is usually where I put my distro kid, um, you know, uh, Let's Google it my distro kid link so that way people know or even my Spotify link I can do that so that way people are actually looking for me um, and they know where to find most of my music or to download it you know download the full song uh, that's one thing I would recommend you guys is I'm gonna show you here in a bit on permissions I don't allow people to download my song on SoundCloud only to listen to it because you can actually listen to the full song and download it uh, on Spotify. Well, not download it, but you can, it's kind of like redirecting everyone instead of saying, 
hey, you can't really download it on here, but you can listen to my Spotify. You can listen to it on another streaming service. You know what I mean? Listen to more of my music. And actually, you know what's going to be better is I did create um, a link to all my songs on my profile, and it's called a fan link. And if you guys want to know how to do that, I will post that up here um, so that you guys can check out that video. But I did create a fan link dot two, and that is JC Flames. This is pretty much just my profile that's on every single streaming service that shows um, all of my music that I've ever uploaded. So I'm going to go ahead and to listen to more of my music. Click here, at, boom. And then sometimes here I can say produced by, is me, Jesse Flames. And all right, so the caption, I usually don't do much, you guys, for the caption, which is fine. Before, mind you, before you click save, you're gonna wanna click on meta metadata. Make sure everything's good here. Artist, of course, is JC Flames. Composer, JC Flames. And then release date. Um, let's just go ahead and put today's date. I know it was released another date. So you can choose your release date right here. Contains explicit content. It actually doesn't. Um, so this is the buy link, you guys. So this is the link, again, that you would probably put here to all your music so that people can actually purchase it, which is good. So you're going to go ahead and click on permissions. And again, I leave this off. Cause I don't want people to download it. I want them to go to Spotify, iTunes, all that stuff to listen to all of my music so I can generate income from it. All right. And the last thing I'm going to want to do is click save. And then it usually tells you, it shows the meter right here. Once it gets right here, it tells you it's uploaded and everything's good to go. And that's pretty much it. You guys, um, and you can see it right here as a percentage. Uh, keep in mind that you're going to want to, again, change your profile picture and your banner uh, on your main profile. And also, make sure you guys check out different playlists, check out different upcoming artists, try to network with them, and um, see if they'll listen to your music when you, know, you repost some of theirs, so maybe they can repost it. You can also do promotions on SoundCloud. I've done that a couple times. I will make a video about that pretty soon, too. Uh, there's certain profiles that offer promotions. You pay like 20 to 50 bucks and they will repost it on their profile and maybe they get, uh, they have like 60,000 followers or they get, you know, 11K listens on most of the songs they upload. So there's, there's opportunities a lot on SoundCloud, you guys. You do not want to miss out on it. So that's pretty much it. Um, let me know what you guys think. If you have any questions, or anything like that, drop them in the comments below. Also, do not forget to like and subscribe, please, guys. It helps me a lot. Thank you so much. And um, JC out. And so, yeah, um, now we're done. This is perfect timing. So as soon as this is done, it fills up. Again, it's reprocessing. You should see it right here. And you will see this link right here. You can post it anywhere, you guys. Um, but that's pretty much it. Again, you guys, don't forget to like, subscribe. Let me know if there's anything else you want to see. All right? JC Flames out. I'ma be somebody. I'ma be somebody. And I promise one day that I will be. I'ma be somebody.